back. So, got a little unboxing here, as you can tell what it is. Well, maybe you think you know what it is. Let's get this top open. Got a little Squire mini strat. And this, my buddy at work, Drew, bought this for his niece. And perfect. <laughs> so, what I'm going to do is, uh, well, actually, I'm here to assess what I'm going to do. I think we're going to start by filing the fret ends. Now, these tuners don't look too bad. At least they're sealed. And neck is fairly straight. Action that doesn't look too bad. But it sure is high down here. So what we're going to do is uh, file the fret ends, uh, set the intonation, make a truss rod adjustment if need be, lower the action because if you want your child to continue playing guitar you need to give them a guitar with low action that plays well. Because, you know, the fingers are going to hurt after a little while. But it makes it even worse when the action's a mile high. Now he came to me and he asked me what kind of guitar he should get for his niece. And uh, I told him one of these or uh, the Epiphone Les Paul Pee Wee. Um, both decent guitars. And uh, you can get them to play well. And when it's time to sell it, either because your child has decided it no longer wants to play guitar and would rather play video games or something, um, they have a higher resale value. This one? It's a Fender, and we're going to make it play well and uh, make it a guitar that, that she can be proud of. So let's get to it. Okay, so it's not a string through. The strings just come through the back of the bridge. So I'm going to take the string, get the strings off so I can file the fret ends so we don't have a cheese grater neck. And uh, what I'm just going to do is uh, pull the five bolts and just remove the entire bridge and get it out of the way so I don't have to take all the strings off.
let's flip this little beast over. Make sure. Everything is tight. better now. Fret ends are filed. Um, the neck bolts were loose. Tuners were loose. Checked all the pickguard screws. They seem to be good. <clears throat> so now let's put the bridge back on and see how the intonation is. Okay, so we'll set the string height. Totally playable. So, let's check the intonation.
definitely better than the first guitar I ever had. <clears throat> anyway, here she is. Fender Squire Mini. I love red guitars. She should dig this. She's going to love it. Uh, she plays nice. Sounds pretty damn good. Sounds just like a Strat. No mistake in that. So what I do to it? I tightened up the uh, tuna pegs because they were loose. I followed the fret ends because it was a cheese grater. Um, I lowered the action because it was set way too high. This neck doesn't have much of a radius on it. It's fairly flat. Neck didn't need adjustment. And yes, it actually does have a truss rod. So. I know one little girl is going to have a very Merry Christmas. And I know a pair of parents who aren't. <laughs> anyway, that's it for this one. And just remember, if uh, if you're looking for a guitar for a beginner or a child, think about one of these or the um, the Epiphone Peewee Les Paul. This this is a nice little guitar. If I got this for Christmas when I was like eight years old, I'd be absolutely giddy. Anyway. You guys take care of yourself, and we'll see you in the next video. Peace.